Before my stroke, I was a nurse at Boston Children's Hospital. I was out in my house. I was living with two roommates. I did CrossFit. Um, I was healthy. Um, I didn't think I could have a stroke at such a young age. I woke up and I couldn't feel anything on my right side. Um, but I just thought I had slept on it weird. Um, so I c was confused because I couldn't get my right arm or like right leg to wake up. So I went to the bathroom because I figured moving around, I can wake them up that way. Um, but my right leg wasn't working, so I fell down a lot. I didn't think I was having a stroke because I didn't fall into any of the risk factors for having one. So my roommate, who is also a nurse, found me um, and she said, like, are you okay? And I couldn't even speak to her. I couldn't even like mumble to her. She called 911, which is what you're supposed to do. Um, and they take me to the hospital. Um, and I was already in the MRI machine um, by the time my family got there. It affected my whole left side of my brain. I was the first person in my family to test positive for factor five, a blood clotting disorder. And they only tested me for that because I had a stroke. Um, and I was on uh, birth control, um, like a lot of women are, um, and the hormones reacted with factor five, and that's why I had a stroke. Uh, by the time I was out of rehab, I could say, my name is Jamie Kelly, how are you, and I love you, and that's all I could say for like a month. I. It's hard for me to do like fine motor things. Um, and if I can't see it, I can't do it. Um, now I am going to speech therapy uh, three times a week. Um, and I'm also in a, a book club um, uh, with other stroke survivors. Um, and I'm in music therapy uh, two times a week. So I'm, uh, I'm giving a lot of attention to my like speaking and uh, reading and writing. I'm not back to where I was before my stroke, but I'm getting better every day. If you walk by me on the street, you can't tell I had a stroke. Um, Everyone says you're so strong, you're like inspiring us. And like, I didn't want them to think I was like weak and like I'm broken and beautiful because I'm like sad. I'm like suffering PTSD. I'm mad, but I'm still like strong. I'm still like going to fight and like I'm still going to like stand up for what's right. So if you see signs of uh, a stroke, act fast. Facial drooping, arm weakness, speech difficulties, time to call 911 because time lost is brain lost.